welcome to the Wee Question channel and today I'm going to be filming my first vlog so welcome to that. So today I'm just going to be going down to the horses, bring them in, give them a feed, a little bit of groom, just some TLC and go down for some cuddles but currently it's like minus three today, you can see my breath so we won't be riding sadly. Um, the arena will be frozen, it's just too dangerous, too slippery, don't want the horses getting hot and yeah just currently sitting in my car waiting for it to warm up and then we'll get going. So this is my OOTD, my outfit that I'm going to be wearing down at the yard and what I've got is just a random base layer that I got from Decathlon and then my high equestrian leggings that are amazing absolutely love them they're so comfy nice to ride in some forganza socks and i've got a adidas just normal running top underneath just to keep warm and i'll also be putting a jacket on oh and my cute little scrunchie can't forget that i love them so yeah so i've just got down to the horses and done their beds, done their hay nets and just about to bring them in now, give them a wee bit of feed and like I say just groom them and get them ready so let's go. So I just usually open the gate and shake some buckets and they usually come. Come on then! Come on then! Good girl! There we go, Lila's coming first and then there's Eva. Come on! Come on! Come on! So they already were fed this morning so just going to give them a wee bit of um, cubes just to be saying like it's a positive thing to come in they get a wee feed so encourages them to come in because they're a pain sometimes to be caught so there we go and Eva's just waiting for it yes So just eating I'll tell you what I've done before I started filming again. So the bed was up, they have a straw bed and I just put it down and give them a wee bit of fresh straw and yeah. So this they live out all year round so it's only just straw to give them something to comfort to stand on, encourage them to pee and yeah. And then I filled up the hair nets so they've got something to munch on when they're in and filled up the waters and then just the same for Lila as well. It's a straw bed and hay net and the water is around there. Hey, So just going to give Eva and Lila a groom, get them all looking fresh. They always get these little ball things stuck in their mane, so when you fix that. Oh, hello Eva, you saying hello? She's got some dirty face. She should be doing some rolling. I think it's somewhere feed as well. You got into a mess, yes. And I'm going to use one of the magic brushes, absolute godsend, I love them. So easy to get the mud off and stuff, so. Let's get going.
clink clink. When I'm doing their manes and tails, I always use the Silky Mane and Tail Detangler. It's an absolute godsend just to get all the tangles out their nails, keep it shiny and just maintain their mane and tail, keep it nice and long for growth and everything. So Eva doesn't really like it that much, so we'll see how she is today. Just like to give her a wee treat after she's been groomed today. Well done. She stood nice. She was tolerant of the spray and yeah, now it's Lila's turn. Grim now, and she deserves a wee treat as well. There you go. Good lass. She looks like a donkey now, doesn't she? She's not very alert. Yeah. She a good girl. Oh, nice and clean. They weren't actually too bad because the field's frozen and there's not much muck to roll in. So, actually. Pretty clean for once. Since they're yeah. all groomed now, I'm just going to do a couple of yard duties, like putting some hay, fresh hay out for them, um, fresh water in the field, and then they'll be heading back out. Oh, Eva, are you tired, baby girl? Yeah, she's tired. Come in for a rest, I think. Rugs back on and put them back out in the field. They've got some fresh hay that they can go out to and munch on that for the rest of the evening. He was trying to get to my phone. That's the horses all rugged up, ready to go. So now I just, before they go out, I like to give them a little stretch. So I'll do some treats and make them stretch their necks around to like their back area, just to give them a good stretch and get their muscles active. So let's go to that. coming out and they just follow me back round to the fields. Come on, this way. They're quite good. They just follow me. They know where they're going. Done this many a days. This is Sky. I know Sky. 
still coming, still following me. They're really good, they know where they're going. So, we just fall around. And we've got some hay to eat. Good girl. Come on, Lila. Come on. They're in need of their rugs being fixed, but there's no point because they just ruin them, so they'll get new ones for next winter. So, look at here. They're just going to munch on. And I'll just need to go down and shut that gate, open that gate rather, and just let them in to the other part of the field. But I guess they'll just stand and eat most of their hay the rest of the night. They're really good at living outside. That's why we don't clip them as well because they're nice and fluffy. The horses are way out and all I need to do now is to muck out and put their beds up but that will take me a couple of minutes as we'll be in for a couple of hours. So let's go! So that's the stables we mucked out, just get mucked out and their beds put up in each corner for the next day that they come in. All nice and tidy and the same with Lila's stable as well. Just everything being picked up and the straw being put in each End corner. End of vlog here guys, it was just to give you a wee introduction to what I get up to with the horses on a day I can't ride because of the weather, the arena's frozen, it's slippery outside, just don't want a chance anyone getting hurt. So it was just bring the horse in, give them a wee groom, give them a wee TLC, seeing them and it's time for me to head home. So I hope you enjoyed, please like and subscribe because it means a lot to me and fingers crossed the weather gets better and I, my next video will be a ride with me with probably the two horses so see you soon bye bye